We give them boots, we give them combats, uh, they get mugs, bags, uh, socks, underwear, they get body armour, helmets, uh, pretty much a normal kit issue for a British soldier as well. They come to us and we give them all of the stuff they need out in the field, so your liners, your, your roll mats and everything like that, like everything that we would get in basic training. So when they get out there, they have the same, like the same effect that what we have. When we first started here, they were all already part of the military, so the morale was fairly high. Uh, they already knew what they were doing. So the training course was quite effective for them to just bring their skills higher. We are seeing a bit of a mixed bag now of volunteers as well as those that have already been in the military. Some have previous military experience, some have come straight from the street. We've talked to a few that one day they were an artist or working in a shop and then the next they're here. So it is a combined effort from Ukraine. They're all very willing to be here and they want to help. They've been really good, yeah. Like, especially when you get like the interpreters as well, like you could have a laugh with them because you could say something and then they'll say it, they'll say it in Ukrainian and then like, we'll have a laugh together. It's like one, it doesn't matter that you can't speak, can't speak a certain language, we're all together.